Hello everybody, my name is Nick and you're watching Nick Gaming because well my name is Nick and I play video games. And today just lowering the volume a little bit. Today we will be continuing our Pokemon Crystal Let's Play series. For a quick team recap in case you may have missed it or just forgot. We have Cat Lover the Ghastly with not very good moves at all. We have Abby the Knocked Owl, hopefully keeping her on the team for a long time. Pepe the Bellsprout, which hopefully will evolve soon, with some pretty good uh, moves, actually. Megan the Drowsy, which has been really fun to use, actually, when she got a new move. <laughs> Todd the Croconaw, it looks like he's telling me to apurate. <laughs> uh, that's so funny. And uh, Kenya the Spiro, which we need to deliver to someone. Why won't I just keep the Spiro? Well, I was never a fan of Spiro. I've um, always been a, a Pidgey guy, to be honest. Or when it comes to Gen 2, a Noctowl or Hoot Hoot person. Which we can't do anything to this, so I'm just going to run. And I don't remember... When Ghastly evolves, I think it's either 26 or 31. And I could just be completely lying by accident. <laughs> Today's Thursday. That means bug catching contest is on today. Oh, the rules are simple. Using one of your Pokemon. One, okay, wait, wait, hold on. Hold on. Let, me, let me just gain brain cells again. Using one of your Pokemon. Catch a bug Pokemon to be judged. Would you like to give it a try? Um, yeah, sure. Uh oh, oh, no. You have more than one Pokemon. Heck no, I ain't gonna use Ghastly. This is to catch, so I'm going to use, since they're bugs, um, let's do Megan. I know Megan's already a pretty high level, but I've never used a Hypno or Drowsy before in a playthrough. Like, I've, well, technically, I've never used um, any of these Pokemon in a completed playthrough, but I never made it as far. Anyways, let's do this again. This time, we'll use Megan. Yes, I'll give it a try. Uh oh, I have to use Drowsy. Um, Megan, actually. Yep, that's fine. We'll hold the other Pokemon while you compete. Next Pokemon, we're left with the cont contest helper. Here are the uh, park balls for the contest. You can receive 20 park balls, okay. The person who gets the strongest bug Pokemon is the winner. You have 20 minutes. Oh no, if you run out of park balls, you're done. You can keep the last Pokemon you catch as your own. Go out and catch the strongest bug Pokemon you can find. Alright, so my immediate thought process is to find a Heracross or Scyther. That's gonna, because Heracross is extremely powerful, so that's not worth my time. <laughs> Megan looks so disappointed. Okay, yep, not worth my time at all. I want a Heracross. That would actually be a really cool addition to the team, but I don't know who to swap out for that. Nope, Paris is not that uh, good either. Now, I hope this works as a, like the Safari Zone. It doesn't. You just have to hope <laughs> that 20 minutes are isn't isn't close. Okay, that's probably I don't know, actually. What is the weakest bug type Pokemon? It's probably like Metapod, right? Because Kakuna can learn. Poison thing, I think it is. This grass looks different, and that's cool. <sighs> okay. Come on, Heracross or Scyther. That would be extremely cool right now. Oh gosh, okay. Not what I'm looking for. Man, 
Yeah, I think those would be probably the best. I don't think pincer is in... Maybe it is. I'm not actually sure. Yeah, but if we can get Heracross, though, that would be extremely helpful and extremely cool. Heracross is, like, such a cool Pokemon to me, and I've never actually used it either. So, that would be extremely cool to use Heracross for the first time. I mean, at least even for a bit. I wonder what the uh, other bug catchers are talking about. Or if they battle you, which would be kind of scary. Since I'm only using Megan. I feel like this is this game's um, Safari Zone. If you got the time to chat, go find some bug Pokemon. Wow, bro. Man, I keep finding, like, weak Pokemon. That's not what I need. I need strong Pokemon. And, you know, probably I'm just now realizing Heracross isn't this early into the game. But, oh my gosh, Pinsir looks so cool! And it's level 13. Um, yeah, sure, heck yeah, okay. Well, we can use hypnosis to put it asleep. Okay. And I'm gonna try one park ball, and then if that doesn't work, I'll try to use pound. Hopefully that won't kill it. One. Oh, dang. Okay, it shouldn't wake up. What? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Well, obviously, it's not even going to shake. Yeah, I wasn't even asleep. Vice grip, okay. I didn't... I didn't heal? Oh. <laughs> oh, whoops. Do I have an option for a... Do I have the option for a bag? Nope. Wait, Pokemon. Oh. Um, okay, hopefully Pound won't kill this thing. Oh, it doesn't. It pr barely does anything. Is this thing really defensive? Well, psychic is physical, so... Oh! Okay, it's in the yellow. I think one more pound, and I probably can catch this. As long as I don't get a crit. Ooh! Okay, he's still asleep. Let's go, Megan. Alright, park ball. Yes! Pincer was caught! Oh, well, this is my first time actually having a pincer. I, I don't know why, I think just pincer is such a cool design. Like, it has its pincers on its head, but it looks like horns and they're spiky. Let's go. I don't think I get to keep pincer, which kind of sucks. But that would be super cool if I could. If I can find a hair across this early too, though, that would be awesome. So I... Uh, okay, let's uh, catch this. It's level 12. It shouldn't have that many weak moves, right? Should have at least have one good one. Because if we're battling, then I better catch as many decent to strong ones I can actually find. And it looks like we caught this one. Okay, perfect. Yep. Oh, I've already caught in pincer. Well, Pincer's health is at 41. It's level 13. Switch Pokemon? No, I would not like to. Okay. So, my next goal is to find maybe a Heracross. Trainer tips. Print out mail by opening it, then pressing start. What? Printing mail? I have no clue. Um, yeah. If we can get a Heracross, that would be extremely helpful. Ah, it's just a Venomat. Okay, not a Venomoth. That's okay. We're just going to uh, run from this one. Am I able to open a bag? I am not able to open the bag. Okay. So I can't heal Megan. Wait, how do I get... How do I get that Pokeball? Hold on. That means there's a way to get out of here, right? 
Is that is that what that means? It has to, right? Just wandering off, not even trying to catch any Pokemon, just trying to find something. Um, that's to exit, probably. And it doesn't look like there's a way to get out. Ooh, trash cans. Ah, you can't search them. Are leftovers in this game? I'm not actually sure at all. Oh, okay, we got a new encounter. Hopefully the uh, Heracross. No, but it is a Butterfree, which is pretty cool. This is level 14. So I'll, I'll try to catch this, but I think Pinsir is going to be our best bet. Um, no, okay. So I'm going to put this to sleep. And catch this thing. I never knew this was in the game. I didn't, well, I guess I never made it past. Well, I, Eh, I never made it past, like, the Ruins of Elf. Oh, yeah, uh, oh, thank god. Uh, that's not what I meant to do. I never got past the Ruins of Elf, so... I never got four in this game. Oh, no, please do not use Stone Spore. Oh. <laughs> okay. I did not need to worry at all. Try to do hypnosis again. I don't know if... Oh, by the way, I know this is a little late into the video. But if you have suggestions for Pokemon names, please do. Please, please write them down in the comments. Pepe, um, Pepe the Bellsprout was a suggestion from Bubble Fortress. Really cool YouTuber, you should check him out. Um... So leave suggestions, please. It's really fun to name Pokemon after what you all uh, name them after, or want them to be named, I mean. There we go. Oh, come on! I really hope one more pound won't kill, but it might. Oh! I think it's at 1 HP exactly. Jeez. Alright, this should definitely work. It's in the red now. It's asleep. Having hypnosis. Oh my jeez. Wow, we really just wanted to wake up, didn't it? Here, you're in the red. How much will you shake without being asleep? Once, twice. Man, I, I don't know. Oh, come on. Wait, wh why? Stupid butterfly. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's gonna do like two damage, so we're fine. Oh, oh, oh no. Huh. Well, how y'all doing today? Question of the day is, how are you doing? Are you doing good? I hope so. Oh, wow, a crit, a crit did four. Amazing. But yeah, I hope you all are doing good. Um, if y'all have school, I hope that's doing pretty good, too. Um, I'm just chilling right here, trying to catch this. Finally caught this butterfly. Okay. Oh, it's new data was added to the Pokedex. Cool. Butterfree, the butterfly Pokemon. Alright, now, I already do have Pinsir, so let's see the difference. So its health is 43, its level is 14. So sadly, I'm sorry, Pinsir, but I will switch you out. Butterfree does seem to be a little stronger. And if we can get a Heracross, I know I keep saying it, but Heracross is dummy OP. That's not a Heracross. <laughs> oh no, now I'm slower. I can run from things though, I think I'll be fine. 
Um, there's, okay. About to say there's an area over here now. There's, I don't wanna waste, I don't wanna waste my time on a Caterpie. If we can keep the Pokemon that we catch, that'd be extremely cool. What is, what's over here? You still have eight minutes left. Oh, um, no, I do not want to finish now. I have eight minutes left. Jeez. Is that, is that like real time? <laughs> if so, I'm very surprised. Kakuna looks like he wears a tie. Anyways, um, yeah, I think Butterfree will be the strongest Pokemon. I think so. My Butterfree, I think, I think I got this. Let's talk to this guy. You should weaken the bug Pokemon first, then throw a ball. Yes, I've been putting him to sleep too. I've been knocking him unconscious. Oh wow, another Butterfree. Hope it's level 15. Oh. Waste of my time. Okay, um. Never mind. It's just been weak Pokemon now. Oh, it's level 15, okay, um, it's health probably isn't that much, so we'll pound to see how much this will do, oh no, no, me again, oh no, I'm gonna throw a ball, I could die, Oh, that was easy. <laughs> okay, never mind. I'm good. Hurry, bug Pokemon. Yeah. It has a higher level, but it doesn't have that much health. So I'm not going to switch it out. Now, let me get my paralyzed elephant thing. I don't know. I still have six minutes left, but I do want to finish now. Okay, please wait here for the announcement of the winners, okay? Okay, nice. We will now judge the Pokemon you've caught. Okay, we have chosen the winners. That was fast. Oh, I was third. I'm fine with that. That's top three. Score was 321 points. Placing second was Picnicker Cindy, who also got a Butterfree. Okay. Uh, not very interesting. And the bug catching contest winner is Camper Berry, who caught up. <sighs> oh, dang. What does that even do? I'm not sure. Oh, that's so cool. We get to keep it. Um... I don't know, Stuv, Stuvy, nah, Stuv. Yep, that's fine. I can't leave. Okay. Today's contest is over. Hope you participate in the future. I definitely will. That was extremely fun, actually. Uh, can I go now? Thank you. Oh, oh, ooh, 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 berry tree. It's an eye. Oh, okay, so it probably heals me from freeze or frozen, being frozen. What a, what's a gold berry do? Because in Pokemon Go, you know, obviously they work different, but I know that makes Pokemon a lot easier to catch. Oh, it heals 30 HP compared to probably a normal berry, I think healing 10, so that's interesting. Okay, that's cool. Let's go down here. Oh my god, wait. Is Megan, like, still absolutely crippled? Yep. Definitely. Okay. Well, there's a new area to catch Pokemon, so that's cool. Should definitely heal Megan. 
Yeah, let, let's go do that real quick. I'll be right back after I heal Megan. Okay, I'm back, and I switched the front of the party. Uh, instead of Megan, I switched it to Cat Lover. Because Cat Lover needs some levels. Are you... Oh my god, wait, there are trainers here. Let me tell you how proud my darlings make me. I'm assuming you mean your Pokemon. I didn't read the first bit of dialogue. Oh. Snubble, uh... Oh no. Oh. It is a normal type though. Um, get some XP on Pepe. Yeah. I think Victory Bell. I don't know how to spell it, but I think Victory Bell is actually a solid grass type. So, hopefully we get uh, Weeping Veil soon. Because I think for Victory Bell you need a Leaf Stone. But I don't... I'm not sure. Ah, uh, had a... had a berry. Yeah, okay. Here, I'll use Growth. Raises my special attack and special defense? Nope, just special attack. Lowers my speed. Okay. Well, that's alright, because it'll use Bite. But I'm going to, um, oh, come on. Of course the flinch happened. Now it's going to do a little bit more damage. But I think this vine whip should end it. Yes, it did. Okay. I forgot a little bit of XP as well. And Pokemon, uh, okay, didn't get to read her name. Didn't matter, though. What matters is that I can actually even catch Pokemon here. Which I find extremely cool. I don't want to be in your line of sight. If I can catch like a pincer. That, why are you in a, isn't this a bug park? Are you good chief? <laughs> why is it just a Psyduck here? Ah, okay. Uh, there's just a lot of duck. I mean, it's it's a park. Yeah, ducks at a park makes sense. Um, this is gonna do like nothing. Oh, oh, well, I got the paralyzation. I'll be back in twenty years when this is over. Well, we did get a level up from Cal Lover, nineteen now, and uh, nothing nothing special really happened. Honestly, level up, and that's about it. I can't hit this thing. Just gonna run away from that. And... Try to catch uh, a cool Pokemon. Hopefully. Okay. We can come back during the day, just... I hope someone can remind me to do that. Come back during the day. I'm totally gonna forget. But anyways, Route 36, we already got the berry, so let's try to see if we can catch any Pokemon here. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Please don't have water types. I don't want to use Pepe. Oh, you have one Pokemon. Flying is super effective on, on grass, right? Hmm. Oh god. This is gonna take a long time. I'll be back. I know y'all... Do you really want to see me battle this thing? No. 
so I'll be right back. I'm sorry, but Cat Lover is so bad. When it evolves, it's gonna be such a good Pokemon, but... Oh, God, it's so bad right now. It's at 4 HP. And I got, you know, I'll blame myself. Rightly. That's... Is that a word? I will blame myself for not getting potions. Oh my god, level fives? What is this? This is in route one? Jesus Christ. Why is level fives here? Come on, give me a different Pokemon too. Yeah, so I kind of need to heal now and get potions. So I'll be right back again. <sighs> I forgot that soda pops are really good. I okay, fresh water, cool. I, I can't trade. I'm on an emulator. <laughs> Have you tried the vending machine drinks? Your Pokemon will love them too. Who thought it was a good idea to like give their Pokemon drinks that people drink? You know, like... What? Sc screw you, man. <laughs> Who thought that was a good idea? Oh, there's a couple more people here. What's this guy doing? Pardon, who says an adult can't get into this? I'm going back every day. With all the dolls. The machine pulls all the dolls. If the money with the crank is almost empty. Ha! <laughs> Alright. Well. Let's just go down the elevator. I. Oh. Wait. What the heck? I thought there was like an elevator, elevator lady. What the? I guess that's generation three. Wow, okay. Is this still the exact same? Yeah, it, it is. Okay. Okay, well, let's go to uh, floor one, I guess, right? And, um, probably end off the episode soon, but I just want to get back to where we were and explore. We'll battle that trainer and then explore a little bit. Uh, are you important? The department store has a decent selection. Some items are only available uh, at game corner prices. Yeah, gambling. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Well, I... Hold on, I'm gonna check something. And, uh... When I'm back, we'll be at the spot we were. Oh, yeah. When... Be... You you got the idea. Uh, so here we are, and we'll battle the trainer. Go to the left, and probably end the episode off there. Thank you so much for watching all the way through. I do appreciate it. Oh, this guy is like, ah, oh, he's a he's a psychic. Yes, finally, ghosts effective on psychic. Well, I mean, that's a thing for a long time, obviously. This is an old game, but finally, I have something to be super effective at. The thing that sucks, though, is that I'm also poison type, so psychic is also effective on me. It, mm. Another Abra? Okay, interesting. This is going to be a quick battle for me, though. Hopefully... Oh, wow. I... Flash? Really? Uh, aye, aye. I think it is 26. I, I don't think it's 20 that Caliber will evolve. I doubt it. You're gonna, yep, I thought so. Kadabra, okay. Kadabra is actually 
could hurt us a decent bit. So we're going to hope for the best. Yep, okay. Ooh, that could hurt. I I barely won. Jeez. That hurt a lot. <laughs> but Calover got a lot of XP from that. Alright. Yeah, you did misread me. No evolution, just as I thought. So, real quick, we're going to heal Calover, go off to the left, check a little bit on the right, and... Well, the episode was going to end there. Um, I do want to see. So, by 50 and by 60, by 20. Uh, we'll use uh, a fresh water on Caliber. There you go. Okay. Oh, there's a little spot down here. Interesting. Not 35. Uh, wait, what the? I don't know. I don't have the Pokemon that knows cut anymore. Uh, oh no, okay. Okay. Someone's getting knocked off the team for a little bit. Look, I think. I, no, I don't want to remove the mail. Uh, Blueby, what? The, oh God. Okay. Um. Wait. Move Pokemon with mail. There is a Pokemon holding mail. Please remove mail. Why? Why? Oh my gosh. Okay, um, the mail, I'm going to take the mail and move it to my PC. Okay, fills. I feel like this is the first time I've saved, like, in-game. Okay. So, Kenya, move here. All right, so we got Stuve, ah, Bluebee, F, and Adian, which I will move to here. We don't have that much, that many Pokemon, don't we? All right, that's okay. So, uh, we go here, so I just want to check. So, my PC in Wood. Draw mailbox. Randy. And I can. Okay, perfect. So. Now I can actually use cut. Cut this little tree down here. You cut, you want to use cut? Yes, I do. Okay. Um, I feel like we've been here before. Hmm. Wait a minute. Yep, okay. <sighs> Gosh dang it. <laughs> That was my only damaging move. Use disable. Oh no. There we go.
Oh, <laughs> well, oh. He's dead. <laughs> there we go. So since the um, caliber is only asleep, I don't need to really heal that. So I'm just going to get a uh, potion. Heal caliber. There you go. Okay. Nice. This episode is getting dragged out way too much. I have school tomorrow. <laughs> I can't be doing this. Uh, okay. Let's just go battle this trainer right here. This, this lady. Oh, oh, oh. Listen, listen, I sprinkled water on that wiggly tree and jumped right up. It just has to be a Pokemon, I bet. It would be shocked. This guy is such a dude. I know. I'll tell my sis and borrow. Oh. Okay, bye. Hmm. Well, uh, okay, I'll do this in this episode because I'm going to be confused next episode. I think I have to run all the way back. So, so I'm back at the flower shop where I'm assuming she told her sister, la 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 la, water, okay, good for you. Uh, when I told my sister about the tree, she told me it's dangerous. If I beat Whitney, I wonder if she'll, when we, I, I did beat Whitney though. I, I did. Are you, are you the sister? No. What's, what, where do I go? Yeah, I, 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 I beat Whitney. <laughs> yeah, thanks. F f f nerd. <laughs> Alright, bye. Uh, well, oh, yes, Nightshade. Oh, yes, please. Yes, 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 delete an old move. Uh, hypnosis is good. I don't use Spite. Spite is kind of bad. This lowers the PP of the enemy's move. You know, it's, it's not that useful. Another attacking move is extremely helpful. So, Nightshade, I'm glad I know that now. Or Caliber knows that. Alright, I think now I can get past this stupid tree and end the episode because I'm tired. It's a weird tree. Use the squirt bottle? Yes. Nikki, use the squirt bottle. A, a don't like that, huh? Yeah. Oh, oh my god. I'm getting assaulted by a tree. <laughs> but I'm going to catch this tree. It's a pseudo wudo. Pseudo wood. And then an O at the end. So this should do 21 damage because Nightshade does the same amount of damage as your level. Okay, yeah. Yeah, okay. Huh. Why did that do so much damage? Todd? Yeah, you, you got this one, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. This can do nothing, right? Because it's not very effective. Did more than I wish it would. Um, here, let's just do Scratch and see how much that does from Todd. Oh, oh yeah. Huh. Why, why does this tree know karate? I'm gonna bite rocks. Oh, it flinched. That's actually so good. Alright, I'm gonna bite it one more time. I think Todd can live... Oh. Oh my god, he can. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're immediately going to, um. Yeah. So far, the moves can't really be too scary for Pepe. Oh. 
I have an ultra ball, right? Yeah. Okay. I think I can catch this thing in the ultra ball. Which is orange. I love that. That's so cool. One, two, three. Let. Ooh. Five Pepe. Oh my god. This Pepe is a beast. Um. We could try to get Megan to put it to sleep. Because I do want to catch this thing. Pseudo Wudo is kind of interesting. I don't. I don't think I'd use it, but it's interesting. Uh oh. Oh yeah. Alright, uh, go 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 sleep now. It costs forty minutes, no one's gonna watch this episode. <laughs> Comment on banana tree if you watched all the way to the end. There's gonna be like two of you. <laughs> this tree looks like a banana bill. Like gut in it. Okay, it's in the red, it's asleep. I don't know if a Pokeball will work though. It definitely did. Okay. Well, we got the Pseudo Wudo. That's extremely cool. Pseudo Wudo, the imitation Pokemon. If a tree branch shakes when there is no wind, it's a Pseudo Wudo, not a tree. It hides from the rain because it's actually a rock type. You're going to be named Banana Tree. I think I have just enough room to put in tree. Banana tree. <laughs> yep, makes sense to me. I have a feeling they're going to be trainers. Okay. No, we're, we're okay. So let's catch one more Pokemon and then we can end off the episode. Or not. Come on, give me a good Pokemon. Give me a cool Pokemon. Oh my gosh, three berry trees? Black apricorn? Oh, that could be made into Pokeballs, right? From that guy in, um, what is it? Not Violent City. Cherry Grove? And it's blue, so it's probably Great Ball, Pokeball, and Ultra Ball, right? Because Ultra Balls are predominantly black. That's extremely cool. And... <sighs> Nothing of interest. Alright, well, I'm gonna wrap it up here. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Um, I hope you have a good day. Night, morning, and evening, you know, all times of day. Hope you have a um, great rest of your day, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.